Hi, Karthik and Jagadish in here and uh, today we are going to see how to create a permit within a few clicks. So this is the model which I have created. So this tutorial shows how to create uh, this primate model I'm not going to you know cover uh, you know the material structure and other stuffs just I'm going to give you the uh, give you the tips how to create this primate very quickly okay let's start so for that I'm going to create a new blender file to start start from scratch so by clicking general I'm not going to save this uh, this code changes so uh, we are I have created a new blender file I'm going to move this cube little bit that side by pressing G and by pressing Y I have I'm moving this cube little bit to give some space and <coughs> sorry I'm going to create it <coughs> I'm uh, <coughs> sorry I'm going to create a uh, cone model here so in that cone model I'm going to give only for four side that's fine and radius 2.5 and depth 2.5 that's it I'm going to scale it little bit by pressing S I can able to scale it this pyramid okay so yeah so I got the shape of the pyramid over here okay cool okay uh, after that you have to select uh, the particles tab on the right side so just select the particle tabs and right by pressing the plus sign you can create a new particle settings and I'm going to give the test a hair yeah and if you see I don't want the below vertices here so I don't want the below hair particles here so that uh, I'm going to delete this face so for that I'm going to change to edit mode and face and selecting the face pressing X deleting the face right so my face is deleted right and now I'm going to change to object mode <coughs> so cool so right now I have the hair particles only for that particular four faces right so once uh, once you see the view as like this so now we can go for uh, the render view here by pressing this and select render as to object and select the object instance object as cube so now we got the uh, you know the cube uh, particles all over the primate surface so now we have to tune it up a little bit <coughs> now we have to tune it up a little bit so that <coughs> first I'm going to change the rotations here if you see uh, there is no rotation uh, options here for that you have to press this advanced settings so now you can view the rotation options here by by checking the rotation option so you can control the rotations over here so I need uh, the rotation in the Z axis so that I'm rotating it so for that I need 0.25 so that's enough for me okay still this not happening so I'm going to increasing a little bit to get the shape of what I'm looking for okay still I'm not getting the shape which I'm looking for and the problem is the rotation axis which was pointing to velocity hair so I don't want to the velocity and hair I am going for a I'm going for the object Z axis boom so now I have the rotation which I'm expected so now I have the you know the model as like here but the step by step uh, you know the blocks are there covered here right so next you have to select 
the velocity which will increase the rand which will give you the random sizes uh, for the particular cubes so I'm going to increase a little bit uh, to give the random size of the cube so that's fine and I'm increasing the normal so that I can have the models a little bit heavier okay increasing it decreasing it okay yeah that's fine for me okay I'm going for 0.25 again here so that's fine for me here so okay so now it comes to the final step of to having uh, all those you know uh, blocks all over this primary ship so I'm going for the emissions I'm just going to increase the numbers from 1000 to 50,000 boom that's it so now you got your model so the primate model the expectation so how it looks like so it looks like you know the primate uh, reference so I have a model reference here so this is how I have found the solution to create the uh, primate reference with the help of cube and cone okay so thank you for watching please subscribe and if you have any queries please uh, comment below and thank you for watching